Here in that direction and in that position I have to I have to check also that that is this my timing timing in right and now I have to rotate that my my this fly feel at least couple of turns that I check that this timing is fine that I check that now when I rotate that and, and now when we look look in that area and now I am inserting that just in right position and now, now in this position, there should be so that that when we look this timing marks in here, that this mark should be in here, and that mark should be in here, and then these markings in here, they should be should be in this line should be in zero and now this my line in is, is in this 10 position and now it means that now this my timing I'm sorry but now it is wrong okay and this is this is now bad thing because now if this yellow line it should be in here in this zero position and now they are in 10 that means that now this my timing when we look in here look now it is wrongly okay as it means that now that line should be in this zero line in here it should be in that this position in that way and now it means that my timing is wrongly because this is this right position but in the same time these markings they, they are in they are in wrongly because that line should be in just in this direct line and now they are a little bit a little bit in wrongly and also that that line is also wrongly because it should be in this position look there is this line markings and it seems that now this my my timing is one teeth away okay because that and this is only one one only teeth look one teeth wrongly okay and what that means and if I have now this situation now that means that this engine runs poorly if I start to if I start to run with that kind of setting then this my engine runs badly okay and now what I have to do now I have to open this my timing chain cover again and install this this timings timing chain in right position okay that kind of information